Hello everyone, it's Lisa from Epic Yarn Gems. Long time no see, but me and the gems are back. It has been a while, about four months. Uh, we're doing really well. Uh, life just got very, very busy here. Um, we had a wedding, we had a mini vacation and some other family things. And also working uh, really hard and trying to navigate the pandemic. Um, I was working from home sometimes, um, having to go into the office at others. And believe it or not, somebody, well, I've seen it on Facebook, talked about losing their crow joe. I was wondering, what is losing your crow joe? I can't imagine not wanting to crochet as I would do it every night. But believe it or not, I did lose my crow joe. Um, I'm not really sure if it was just life got busy and something had to give, but I just want to let you know that um, we're back and we're going to be posting more videos, but I thought I'd give you a little sneak preview of what we had been doing um, during our time away from YouTube, as well as a couple projects, which aren't very many, that um, I have done. So the last project I did uh, before we took a break was a baby blanket for someone I work for. I used this Bernat Softy Baby. I love this yarn. I love the color, but um, you need to be very careful that you buy enough before you start your project. I had started this project and had gone through one skein and I had to go buy another set of skeins and sometimes dye lots don't really mean that much as long as you can line things up. Let me tell you, I could see the line clear as day. So I bought enough uh, yarn in the next dye lot or the a full dye lot, but to be really honest, and maybe it's just me, but I could still see the transitions and it bothered me, but pretty much people kept saying, you're the only one that can see these. So the pattern that I used was the Easy Crochet Baby Blanket White Waves by Craft Mart. If you're interested in doing this blanket, it does work up really beautifully. It, it was just the yarn that was frustrating to me. Um, you can go to my Pinterest page because I always post in Pinterest the projects that um, I'm using that aren't mine. So you can take a look there. I um, When I wanted to get back into crochet, I was like, I don't really know what to do. So I went back to my old um, staple, which is making uh, battle caps for the battle cap project. And I went through about 20 of those and it was feeling good. And I've been crocheting ever since. So I'm going to have some new patterns for you. And the next set of videos will be actually a bunch of my yarn reviews. But I did start, I've always wanted to make a Christmas snow. Uh, this is my first attempt at it. I am going to refine the pattern a little bit more. He turned out a little bit short. Um, so I am going to uh, try another one and then write up the pattern so that I can share it with all of you. He did turn out pretty cute, but like I said, he was a little short. So um, we'll give that a try again. I do want to thank everybody who continued to watch my videos um, while we were taking our little break. Uh, we increased our subscriber account, so I really appreciate all of that and all the support everyone has given me through these years. So without any further ado, peace, love, and happiness to you all, and look forward to some new videos coming out. Take care.